What is up guys, HF Masters here, and today we are doing a LEGO City Great Vehicle review. This is on the fishing boats. It retails for $19.99 in the United States, and it comes with 144 pieces. Now one thing I am going to mention is the Great Vehicle line on the top. It shows off three different types of minifigures, which is something new for the uh, new releases of the sets coming out. Now obviously on the front it just shows off the fishing boat and some of the stuff it comes with. On the back it just simply shows off a quick and neat little comic. But that is pretty much it for the box, so let's open this setup. Alright, so here is the fishing boat all complete. Now obviously as you can see there really isn't too much that comes with this set. You get a shark, you get, you know, you get one of these, which is cool, I guess. You know, it doesn't too, do too much, and you get some fish. But otherwise, you know, you get the boat. All right, taking a look at the exterior of the boat, the first thing I want to mention is the fact that on both the sides, it says Sport Fishing, which is probably the brand where this boat was purchased from. I also want to mention that on the back of the boat, it says Mary, which is most likely the name of the ship. Alright, taking a look at the front of the boat, as you can see there are two lights which you can just move around, and then there is also a life tube which you can take off in case if there's anyone stranded in the middle of the uh, water. You can also see that there, it, there's like a window basically, which you can see the minifigure through and then the very top again has a light so you can move that around and then it also has this like plate which you can just like spin around I really don't know what the purpose of that's for but it's, it's, it's cool you know it's a play function so yeah that's pretty cool and then on the side of the boat it has some railings which I really like I don't know why but I think it's a nice detail and you can also like kind of put some extra stuff on there if you want. Alright taking a look at the very back there are just two kind of propellers here that you can spin around and move up and down. Nothing too special. And showing off just a quick floating function as you can see we have a the tub like somewhat filled up with hot water and it is clearly floating, just moving around. I don't know exactly what it's really doing, but it's going somewhere. All right, taking a look at the minifigures along with the fish and the shark, as you can see, you get a decent variety. You get two minifigures, you get one shark, and then you get two different colored fishes. You actually get two orange fish and then one silver fish. But I'm just gonna take a quick look at the shark first, which, not too much going on. I mean, there is some detailing there with the eyes. And of course, you can open the shark up. And you can place a fish in if you want. So the shark can be eating a fish. All right, taking a look at the two minifigures here, as you can see, you can see you get one male who is wearing some glasses or shades. And then you have a female. Taking a look at the back, you can just see some of the printings the figures have. Taking the life vests off, you can see the printing on their torsos. All right, overall, this set is actually a very good set. Now, the piece count isn't really too great, and you can't really do too much with it, just like, you know, without using the water. But because this boat can actually float, you can just have so much fun, at least for kids, to just mess around in the bathtub or in a swimming pool or in a sink, wherever you want, basically. You can just have a ton of fun just messing around with the boat. And because of that, that actually makes the set a very good value. For the $20 price, because of the, you know, the whole floating kind of thing, the 140 pieces really isn't actually too bad. I mean, of course some people want to have a more interesting build, so this set is obviously not going to be for you, and I don't really think any of the sets, city sets are going to be giving you um, the best of the builds. But overall, this set does have a lot of playability for just really kids who just want to have, you know, something to do in either the bath or the pool or, well, really anything to do with the water. 
But that is pretty much it for my review on the fishing boat. I hope you guys enjoyed, and until next time, this is HF Masters saying goodbye.